up and welcome back to my channel. It's been quite some time since I sat in front of the camera. It's been just a very interesting couple of years. Um, but I finally got a nice little setup and I'm excited to bring you guys some really cool fall content that I've been planning for quite some time. So I hope you guys are ready for it all and just what's going to happen uh, with this channel in general. I'm super, super excited about. So, uh, to first start out with, I'm going to show you guys my personal uh, fall boot guide. These are the items that I feel like I need in my closet and I'm hoping that you might be inspired by and may want a few of these pieces as well. A lot of them, no, take that back, a few um, I've had for, um, that I've already had and then I've added three new boots into my collection this year. So without further ado, let's get started. All right, you guys, so my first boot that I had to have in my collection this season was, it's actually a combination of two shoes that I actually have, but they made a baby, <laughs> and they came out with this one. It is the Combat Biker Boot, is what I'm calling it. So I have a pair of Combat Boots already, and they have um, pretty much no heel at all, and they're just slip-ons. And then I also have a combat boot version, but it has a taller heel, and they're really not comfortable, I'll be honest, so I don't wear them often. So I knew that I wanted a combination of both. Like, this is so perfect. I love the detail of the lace-up, and then you have a side zipper, so you can get in and out of so quickly, so you're not lacing up, you know, this entire um, front. So this shoe is from Just Fab. I just got this in. So I have not worn it, but I have worn it inside the house walking around and they feel so comfortable. And I know they are going to be very useful this season. I cannot wait to be wearing them with skirts and just jeans, leggings. I mean, it's a great everyday shoe in my personal opinion that you can just throw on. And you know, I know that you can walk around in these guys probably for quite several hours I I think so I'm excited about these bad boys they're so cute all right so the next boot I'm gonna show is this one is also a combat biker boot which you're probably thinking why do you need two of those are similar well because I like the color the color is like kind of like last year you had the white booty that was so in style it was so in like you know in trend which I have a pair that I wore all the time and they're pointy toe they were a little bit more dressier um, not really so much for daytime, really more for nighttime, but I feel like these are a great style for nighttime. The only thing is, not like the other ones, it does not have a zip up, so you do have to lace these up and down and then do the buckle. So that's a little bit of a, you know, takes a little bit more time, but I think they're so stylish. I think they're going to be so comfortable as well. Just, I can just tell. I've worn them also around the house and I cannot wait to style these for the fall. They're going to be kind of like my new white boot that I had last year. And those are, these are also from Just Fab too. They have a really great, uh, just selection of boots. If you don't, have you ever, if you've never tried it, you should. I really, really, really like their selection a lot. All right, my next one is a taupe booty. I know that typically a cognac color is the most popular one during this time, which I already have a few, but this year I wanted to add a taupe. I've been looking for one for a while, and I loved this heel. I like the height. I like the white stitching. I like the almond toe. It, it's just a really good everyday shoe that you can throw on with. You know, right now it's still warm here in Texas, so you can throw them on shorts and like a sweater and your little booties. You can throw them on with, you know, a skirt or um, your your jeans. It's just a good staple everyday shoe to have. And um, I've already been wearing these a lot, and I got them maybe about a couple weeks ago. And these are Madden Girl, and they're super comfortable. Next shoe is an absolute must. It's actually an older shoe. I've had this shoe, um, this booty for, gosh, three years already, I think. So it is the Pointy Toe Wedge Booty. And I just love it. It's sleek. It's beautiful. Um, and it goes with just everything from day to night with anything. Throw it. I like to wear this with um, 
with not leggings but with tights and a, and a cute little dress and then throw on these booties it just I love this look it just makes your your legs look longer makes you look taller so and they these are from Dolce Vita but these are old I got these on Poshmark and when I bought them they were in great condition and they're still in in really really good condition so if you can't find this which you probably won't because they're old um I would check Poshmark, but if not, I know I've seen some around on the market, so I'll try to find some for you guys and link them down below. Next one, we're going to go to a knee-high boot. All right, another taupe. Like I said, Cognac was a big color, and it, and it still is, and I love. I have a Cognac um, knee-high already, but I got these last year, and um, I actually bought them in the black version as well because I love them so, so much. And they were so comfortable. So I scooped them up in both colors. And what I like about these is that it is a flimsy shaft right here. So you can like slouch it down and it can be a slouch boot. And I love, love that. So, and I also like the pointy toe. It's not really an almond. Um, it's kind of like the same pointy toe and it just makes you look long and taller and I love it so this boot is a great one to have like I said um I will try to see if I can't find this like it was last year they might still have it I'm not sure I haven't really looked these are by these are by Steve Madden so great quality too love them all right moving on so my next boot is definitely going to be a not for everybody probably. Um, and it's a statement piece for sure. I've been wanting a colored pair of knee high boots and I found them. These, these boots are so gorgeous. I love the detail of this like hooded look right here. And when I saw them, I just knew I had to have them. Like I said, these are a statement piece probably not for everybody. Definitely going to be like a day, not, not day, but nighttime outfit. Wait, wow. A, a nighttime outfit and, um, probably keep it simple on the top. And then this will be your loud statement piece. I would wear this with just a, maybe an all black outfit, maybe like a mini skirt or, um, I wouldn't probably go any lower than your knee. And even if you go at your knee, it's going to kind of chop you off, but I would stay above your knee. Definitely a mini skirt with this. Um, or this would also look with a good pair of black skinnies and maybe a black top. And this is your statement piece. They're just so beautiful. I love them and I cannot wait to style them this season. So, all right, you guys, that is it. I have one, two, three, four, five, six pair of shoes that I will be having on rotation a lot. I promise you'll be seeing them a whole heck of a lot um, in these next coming up videos that I'm going to be styling. Also, if you want some inspiration on how I would style these pieces, then watch my little lookbook that I put together for you guys um, on how I style these pieces. But thank you guys so much, so much for sticking through this and watching it. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please give it a like and subscribe. Uh, leave me a comment below, but I have some amazing videos coming up soon for fall. So I hope you guys um, will continue to watch, but I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much and I will see you guys later. Bye. Reason to throw my game, not really why I came Oh, do me a favor, pour me another glass Pour hearts that never last Oh, take me, I'm a wild point Getting bored out looking for attention I'm not looking to meet new friends No Stop.
attention. <laughs> 